My name is Mark McNeil from The Spectator, and uh, the reason I'm here uh, today is I uh, just wanted to add a bit of a footnote to a special feature in uh, Saturday's paper. The feature is about characters in Hamilton, and I wanted to um, tell a little bit more about uh, one of the individuals we focused on, a fellow named Troy Herchabees. Troy Herchabees made a name for himself in a uh, with his uh, company called Project Grizzly, which developed a... Uh, a special suit to protect uh, people from grizzlies. Didn't go so well for him. He lost uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars and uh, eventually abandoned the idea. Um, but I, I wanted to tell, though, a, a story back 20 years ago. He phoned up the paper and he said that uh, he wanted to give uh, The Spectator a, a special Project Grizzly Award. He had uh, read an um, environmental package that we had put together, a special project on the environment, and uh, he thought, um, you know, it was terrible, the things he was reading, and he uh, he wanted to acknowledge this journalism with a Project Grizzly Award. So he asked uh, a representative, me, to go up to um, Mohawk College, where he was renting a room, and he uh, was going to uh, present the award there. So I, I, I went up and uh, was sitting in the audience when, uh, and listening to him from the podium, where he... Uh, went on about the project uh, just just loved it he said and uh, you know it, it's it's awful and um, the type of things that are going on but it's so important that uh, you know the media is reporting on this and uh, you know another good example he said was a PBS special he had seen the previous week about Yosemite Park and uh, <laughs> of course he, he meant uh, Yosemite Park um, but all these years later, I thought maybe I'd take the opportunity uh, today to uh, give something back to Troy. I've uh, written a song about his Project Grizzly, and uh, have a listen. <laughs> 